Hello children, how are you? Good morning all of you. Today we are going to learn your subject English. And chapter number one, Mowgli the Frog. Before the name Mowgli, it is the one of the famous and popular character of the movie Jungle Book. It is also from Jungle Book and written by Rudyard Kipling. So, I will read the lesson for you and you can listen carefully. Also, we should uh, see some of the hard words which is uh, in this lesson. You should write down in your notebook. So, I read this lesson for you. You, can, you should listen carefully and you, read, you also read at your home. The bird grew louder and ended in the full throaty cry of the tiger's charge. Here the charge is the new word, the action of rushing forward to attack somebody. This is the new word for you, charge means by the action of rushing forward to attack, attack on somebody. Then there was a howl, an untigerish howl. From Sher Khan. You also heard this name in Jungle Book. Sher Khan is also a famous character of the Jungle Book story. He has missed, said Mother Wolf. What is it? There is a question sentence. What is it? He has a miss. You see that the one of the verb miss and it's a past tense is a missed. So, Father Wolf ran out a few paces. He heard, here heard is also a past tense of a hear. Shere Khan muttering and mumbling angry as he tumbled about in the scrub. Here is the word scrub means small buses and trees. The fool has had no more sense than to jump at a woodcutter's campfire and has burned his feet. Here you also see one of the past tense for burn, which the main word is burn. B U R N. Burn. What said the father will say? The fool has had no more sense than to jump at a woodcutter's campfire and has burned his feet. Suddenly, the Vashish rustled a little in the thicket and Father Wolf got ready for his leave. There are two new words here. One is the rustle. Rustle means by the sound of the leaves moving or rubbing together. It is a, always happen when the uh, leaves are fell down. When they got a yellow, it would make a sound by the by the wind. It is called rustle. Rustle means the sound of the leaves moving or rubbing together. The another one is thicket, a group of buses growing closely together. A group of buses growing together. He lived before he saw what it was he was jumping at. Then he tried to stop himself. Here one word tried. It is a past tense word here. Tried. Its main word is tried. The result was that he shot up straight into the air for four or five feet, landing almost where he left the ground. Man, he snapped. A man's cube, a cup, look directly in the front of him, holding on to a low branch, stood a neck brown baby who could barely walk. It is a neck brown baby, he stood there. He looked up into Father Wolf's face and laughed. Is that a man's cup? Say Mother Wolf, I have never seen one 
bring it here. Father will choose close right on the child's back. He carried it gently and laid it down among his cups. How little, how mad and how bold. These all are exclamatory sentences. How little, how mad and how bold, said Mother Gold softly. The baby was pushing his way between the cups to get close to the warm height. Height is animal's skin. Skin of animal is called height here. Aha! He is uh, taking his meal with the others. He is altogether without hair. I could kill him with a touch of my foot. But see, he looks up and is not afraid, said the father. The moonlight was blown out of the mouth of the cave. For Seir Khan's great square head and soldiers were thrust into the entrance. Here thrust means uh, push suddenly. Push suddenly. What does Seir Khan mean? asked Father Wolf politely. Yet his eyes were angry. My query? A man's cue went this way. Its parents have run off. Give it to me. Quite. It means by the animals a person being hunted. Sheikh Khan had jumped at the woodcutter's campfire and was furious from the pain of his burned feet. But Father Wood knew that the mouth of the cave was too narrow for a tiger to come in fire. Even when he was, Sheikh Khan's soldiers and four boys were crammed for war to space. Cramped for means without space to move free. You, you have given a sum of the new words in the box on page number 8 and also mentioned in the different color. The words take order from the head of a pet and not from any strict cattle killer, said Father Wolf. The Father Wolf said that the wolf take order from head of the pet and not from any strict cattle killer. The man's cube is all to kill if we choose. You choose and do not choose. What talk is this of choosing? It's your choice. If you are choose or not choose. Am I to stand noisy into your dog's den for what is a rightfully mine? It is I, Sekha, who speak. Now he, Seir Khan told that it is mine. Me means Seir Khan. The tiger's roar filled the cave with the thunder. Mother Wolf shook herself clear of the cups and sprang forward. Here the clear of me by away from. And it is I, Raksha, the devil who answered. The man's cube is a mine, Seir Khan. Second side, the men's cube are mine. He shall not be king. He shall live to run with a pack and to hunt with the pack. That means a group of animals that hunt together. In Sikari, run. So he love live with the pack. In the end, looking hunter of little neck calves, from eater, fish killer. He shall hunt you. Now leave or back you will go to your mother. Bird beast of the jungle, lever than you can into the water. Go. Father would look and amazed. Sorry, father would look on amazed. Sheikh Khan might have a fresh father would, but he could not stand against mother would. Sheikh Khan knew that. Where he was, she had all the advantages of the ground and would fight on the death. So he backed out of the cave mouth, growing his thoughts. Each dog bark in his own yard. We will see what the pet will say to this fostering of men. Here is now a new word fostering. 
bringing up someone else's child as our ones. They get us the human child, human cubs from the jungle who is the someone else. So here the word is used fostering. It's a man cube. The cube is a mind and to my it he will come in the act. My world threw herself down panting among the cubes and father would say to her, she can't speak this much truth. The cube must be a soul to the pet. Will you still keep his mother? He's a without mother. We don't know who is his, who is his mother. So he still stay here without his mother? Keep him, see, cause he came back by night alone and very hungry, yet he was not afraid. Look, he has pushed one of my cubes to one side and red, and that lamb tiger would have killed him and would have run off to a Vaingunga river while the villagers were here hunted through all our liars in revenge. Liar is a place where wild animal lives. Keep him of course. I will keep him lie still little frog. Oh Mowgli, for Mowgli the frog, I will call you. The time will come when you will hunt Sher Khan as he has hunted you. So this is the story about Mowgli the frog. Now all of you write down a hard word which is a given in your book and also I write here. You should be write down in your book. Aapko apni book mein ye saare hard words hai. Wo likhne hai aur ye jo lesson hai pura wo achhi tarah se sunna hai. You can listen. You should listen this carefully and also read at your home. Good one.